All right, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on, Amy. Time to wake up. Come on, Amy. Come on, Amy. Out of her. Come on. Come on. Let's wake up. Mm. It's time to open our meal box. All right, guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. It is our day to open our meow box. Both the cats are really tired. We're in the middle of the coronavirus, so we've all been just kind of chilling, um, hanging out today, and the cats are kind of not really in the mood to film, but I decided, you know, why not? I have some time to film, so we might as well get into it um, because this box came kind of late compared to when the other ones would be coming. So this is the meal box for March. So I'm going to try to go ahead and open it and interest them enough to kind of wake up. Maisie, come here, man. Maisie may not participate because she was so comfy. All right. So as usual, it says hello, Oliver and Maisie. Maisie, man. Maisie. Okay. <gasps> okay, everything looks really good. So I'm excited. Okay, so this one is Take Me to the Candy Shop. That's the theme for this month. Oh my goodness. I feel like this is going to be so cute. Um, if you've watched these before, you know that Oliver loves to tear up the paper. So... I won't be surprised when he starts to do it because he's done it every single video. But we love Oliver, right? We love him and his traits. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. So I kind of want to get everything out. So this, um, oh my gosh, this is so cute. Uh, okay. So this is kind of like a string toy. I don't have any from the other boxes to show you. Um, right here, but it has a string and then it has these on it and then this is a little um, Candy machine. I don't know if you can tell it is so cute. Oh my goodness. Okay I'm gonna go ahead and open it and see if Maisie wants to come over here. Maisie, come here Come here Oh, she's looking at it Alright, so this is what it looks like. It is super cute and you kind of um, go like that and it does have some, you know, give to it so it's not going to just snap if they um, latch onto it, which is good because mine are pretty rough on their toys. Maisie, you interested? Oh, Oliver's already getting something. Okay, let's go ahead and start. Okay, so he's already been into this, um, so this will be fun. All right, so this is a catnip toy. Um, it's from Vermont Homegrown. It has a super cute little tag right there. Um, and this is something that says it's crafted exclusively, exclusively for Meowbox. So that's really fun. It looks super cute. Oliver was trying to play with this one, so I'm going to cut the tag off and then see if he wants to play with it. Maisie is interested in that. She is very playful, but at least she's here and sniffing it, right? Hey, Oliver, look. Hey, looky. Look. Okay. So here's the next one. Um, it is, it says Gummy Bear Cat Toy. It crinkles. A lot of the toys that they send crinkle, and they live for those toys. So it's a little bear and then it has the feathers on it. I'm sure that the feathers won't last very long, but they live for the feathers. And they'll even like carry the feathers around once they pull them off, out of the toys. So um, they really love toys like this. Okay. Hey Oliver, what do you think of this one? 
Let me make sure that they're in the frame. Okay. So now you'll be able to see them and see um, what I'm seeing. Hey, what do you think? He's interested in smelling this one, so I'm going to let him kind of investigate. Okay, this is cute. Okay, so this says sweet candy, swirl candy toy. Um, and it is filled with organic catnip. Um, this is super cute looking. Aww, it's so cute. It, so it looks like it was um, something that was knitted. It looks like it was knit together and it apparently has catnip in it. So once they smell this, they're probably going to live for this. And it's just really round. I feel like this is going to get um, stuck under the fridge um, or something because they always are putting their toys under there on accident and then they have to struggle to get it back out. What do you think, ma'am? Oliver's again getting into the next toy that we haven't opened yet. He keeps going for that one, so let's see. I think it's because it has catnip in it. So this is the last toy that's in our mailbox. Yes, last toy. And it is um, catnip filled gummy worms. And so there's two of them, which is perfect because one for both of them and they don't really like to share so um they're so cute and of course they have catnip in it so they're gonna live for this i'm sure oliver is about to go wild with all this catnip stuff so let's go ahead and all right Maisie, what do you think of that hey oliver look So he is really smelling the um, little gumball toy, um, but they seem really interested and this is the first video where Maisie has really participated. Um, I've said before that she's really shy on camera for whatever reason, but when it comes to normal daily life, she's so playful and all of these toys, you know, get such good use. Um, and just an idea for people that maybe think they have too many toys, like me, now that I'm getting new toys every single month. I think what I'm going to start doing is the toys that they've kind of, they're not as interested in, but they haven't, you know, torn them up, obviously. What I'm going to start doing is bringing those used toys that are still in pretty good condition to local cat shelters because um, I don't want to just throw them away, but we have so many toys. And so I think that's when, what I'm going to start doing is um, just trying to kind of pass it on and not just throw them away because we're getting so many cute toys every single month. Um, and I'm finding cat toys everywhere. I just think we have way too many. So I'm going to start taking those to the cat shelters around town. We have several that I can go ahead and start donating to. And so if you too feel like, you know, you have way too many toys at home, um, don't throw it away. If they're still in pretty good condition, take it to your local animal shelter and cat shelter just to kind of give some love to those cats that may not have that many toys. So this is the March box. It is the um, candy box. I hope that you can see them. Um, I hope that they're in focus. If they're not, it's a bummer. <laughs> um, but I hope that you've enjoyed looking at all of these um, toys that we've gotten. If you are considering, you know, subscribing to this box, I would say go for it. They love these toys. They play with them all the time. Um, Maisie's still playing with some of the toys from the very first box that we got. She carries them around. Um, so, you know, these toys will definitely be used. Um, it, I think it's a great thing to invest in if you have it in your funds to be able to do something for your cats. I think it's really fun. 
So I hope you enjoyed this video and I will hopefully see you in my next one. It will probably be something cat related. I put up a cat shelf, so I'm wanting to do a video about that. So that is what I'm trying to do soon, but we will see. Um, things are really crazy right now with everything going on um, in the world. So um, again, thanks for watching this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys. Alrighty, so here's all your toys. Hey. Easy.